The main purpose of this video is to help those close to you understand what you are experiencing and going through. We want to empower them to support you in dealing with this tinnitus nightmare for as long as it takes to find the help and relief you need. So this video is important to watch and share it with anyone you know who lives with tinnitus, because often their families and loved ones are unsure how to provide the necessary support and assistance to make them feel more comfortable. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give us a like if you appreciate what we do for all tinnitus sufferers, and send this video to all people you know who are desperately looking for help or lost hope. Don't hesitate to share it with your network and make a real difference in someone's life. Did you know that even a slight tinnitus, as we call it using the tinnitus handicap inventory scale, can have a big impact on people's lives? It's true, tinnitus is changing the lives of almost everyone who has this condition. And guess what, it's not just the sufferers themselves who are affected. In fact, their family members and loved ones are often left amazed and scared by the extent of these changes. Let's go back to our discussion of tinnitus, shall we? Like we always say, tinnitus has different faces, and there are various factors that can trigger its onset. But here is the deal. There are some common preconditions that usually play a role, with a few exceptions, of course. Things like exposure to extremely loud noises, think jackhammers, shooting ranges, or crazy loud music concerts, certain medication side effects, or even incidents like whiplash or TBI. Now, here's where things get interesting. Scientific research has shown that the most typical preconditions for tinnitus are closely tied to sky-high anxiety levels and long-term stress. And get this, 75% of cases worldwide are linked to these emotional factors. There are patients of ours who keep on insisting that they do not have any emotional problems. Well, unfortunately, that may not be entirely true. Emotional factors can sneak up on anyone, and they might not even realize it. Research shows that the connection between tinnitus and emotions runs deep. As you know, we specialize in neuroscience at Metro Hearing and Tinnitus Treatment Clinic. And guess what? There is a lot of psychology tied up in everything we do. So here I am, ready to challenge all those who do not see the connection between tinnitus and their emotional well-being. And I will share something you might not be aware of that long-term stress is not something to be taken lightly, because every stressful situation we encounter in our lives leaves a little something behind in our subconscious. It's like carrying around a weight on our shoulders that keeps getting heavier and heavier. Meanwhile, things may appear okay on the surface. Family, income, work, house, a new car should make us happy, right? But let's get real for a sec. If everything in life is so great, why do some people have trouble sleeping at night? What's the deal with that strange sensation of something trembling inside their chest? How about their legs constantly shaking and their hands moving as if controlled by a hidden remote? My friends, the answer is anxiety. It affects nearly 31% of the US population. Crazy, right? Now, let's go back to what we promised to discuss in this video. Tinnitus is not just annoying noise in our ears. This condition has a very negative effect as it changes our personality right before our eyes. You see, tinnitus messes with our subconscious mind, affecting our thoughts and emotions. Remember, tinnitus is really nothing else but abnormally high levels of activity in some parts of our brain, and it makes our poor brains and minds overworked, exhausted, and as negative as possible, and it does show. We are losing patience and tolerance, and our nervousness makes people feel uneasy around us. Even our friends may slowly start fearing they might say or do something to set us off. We are so exhausted, desperately yearning for just a tiny break from this never-ending nightmare, and of course our loved ones are impacted the most. Unpleasant words slip out more often than we'd like to admit. We tell people to get lost or give us some space over and over again. Now, here is something important to keep in mind. As tinnitus sufferers, we are not oblivious to the fact that something is going on. We can sense those slow changes happening within us. But the pain can reach such extreme levels that we do start to lose care. All those arguments and disagreements that happen without a real reason, it's like a never-ending cycle of tension. What's truly heartbreaking is how this condition widens the space between people who used to be so close. 
It's important to remember, though, that this condition is not just about noise. Tinnitus is actually changing our brains and our minds. This is not something people can simply fix themselves. Tinnitus has the power to transform us into someone almost unrecognizable. It's like we've become strangers in our own skin. That's why tinnitus sufferers desperately need support from family members, significant others, friends, and even co-workers. They are going through a tough time, and it's crucial for people around them to keep that in mind, that it's not their fault. This condition messes with their brains, bringing out the worst in them. But deep down, they are still the same wonderful people loved by us. So it's our job to be there for them, no matter what it takes. We should get involved and help them research information and seek professional help. Let's encourage them to take action and explore all available options. We can provide the support they desperately need and help them stay hopeful in the face of this terrible condition. So let's do this the right way. Get informed and seek professional assessments. The internet is full of reliable information. But most importantly, search for professional clinics that have experience working with tinnitus sufferers for years. They are the best source of information. And let's remember that a professional tinnitus assessment can take away a lot of anxiety caused by and connected to this condition. We are like mirrors reflecting the people who matter to us and striving to be the best versions of ourselves for them. Psychology's most fundamental concept is that if you want those close to you to be happy, you must find happiness within yourself first. It's the key to making others happy. It is not easy to make tinnitus sufferers happy, but we have to do everything in our power to make their lives as comfortable as possible. We need to understand what this condition is really doing to them and show them that we are here to support them every step of the way. We've been working tirelessly at our clinic, helping as many people as possible for years. But you know what? Many people in Canada and the US still don't have access to clinics like ours. And that's just not fair. It makes us feel obligated to spread out our expertise and knowledge. And our goal is to reach all those who are ready to transform their lives for the better, whether it's learning how to embrace life with tinnitus or finding ways to get some relief. So join us on this journey. It's time to take control and find the relief you deserve. This channel is for you. Our mission at Metro Hearing and Tinnitus Treatment Clinic is simple, to improve lives. We are committed to doing everything we can to help you find relief and reclaim your quality of life. No matter how big or small the steps, we are here to support you every step of the way. It doesn't matter where you are or what your tinnitus is like. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give us a like if you appreciate what we do for all tinnitus sufferers, and send this video to all people you know who are desperately looking for help or lost hope. Don't hesitate to share it with your network and make a real difference in someone's life.